Yo, what's going on guys? Raph here from BNC Camera. And in this episode, we're gonna show you guys how to load film into a 35 millimeter camera. And another thing to note too on the side as well, as soon as you load up your film, you wanna make sure that you set your ASA properly, or ISO in this case, ISO, ASA. In order to do that, it's gonna be different for each camera systems on mine. Uh, you're gonna push this button down for the OM1, and then you're gonna dial it into whatever ISO film you loaded into your camera system. Again, each camera system is gonna be different, so be mindful of that. Uh, you wanna do this to ensure that your uh, light meter reading is gonna be proper whenever you're changing things accordingly. Okay. All right, so we've got the Olympus OM unloaded with the film already, but you're probably wondering to yourself, how do you take the film out uh, once you're done with it? Uh, most camera systems are going to be different, but this one right here for this Rolly Flex, there's going to be a button you have to depress to uh, release the film. For my Olympus OM1, it's going to be this little uh, dial right here. R for rewind, obviously, so um, that's going to be for that camera system. Again, there's a lot of really cool guides and sites you can check online to um, basically unload the film. So, once you have that, the first thing you want to do before pulling this up to open this door is to basically wind it back. So you just want to wind your film until you don't feel any more tension. Once you don't feel any more tension between here and the actual film itself, that means it's released. And you can go ahead and pull this guy up pop it open, and then go ahead and grab your film. And that's all she wrote. Easy peasy, right? If you guys have any other questions though, feel free to leave them in the comments section down below because each camera system is gonna be different. And now if you guys are looking to grab some film, we do offer options from Lomography, Ilford, Kodak, Revlog, and more options in the future. So definitely check out our online store or swing on down to the shop to ask us what we got in stock. Thanks for checking out this video, and I'll see you guys in the next one.